Did you know that one of the most important things that a trial attorney can do on opening argument is admit a weakness in the case? You didn't know that? Come join me, I'll tell you why. Hi, I'm Jerry Oginski. I'm a New York medical malpractice and personal injury trial attorney practicing law here in the state of New York. An attorney must admit a weakness in their opening, and I'll tell you why. If you fail to admit the weakness in the case, the jury will be shocked. The jury will take it out on you if the first time they hear about the weakness in the case comes from the defense attorney, when now they're going to get up and say, I want you to know something. Mr. Oginski omitted to tell you that his client was a convicted felon. Did you know that? He didn't have the guts to stand up here and tell you. Well, guess what? I did. And you know what? It's a problem. So now what just happened? What happened is that I lost the key opportunity to gain credibility with the jury. I've lost the opportunity because I neglected and omitted a key weakness in my case. Juries typically appreciate the fact when you confess, and you confess to the jury, listen, I have to tell you something really important, ladies and gentlemen. My client, John Jones, you're going to hear from him later, but there's something about his background you have to know. John was convicted 10 years ago of a crime that he committed, and he'll freely admit it. And the reality is, he paid his due to society. He was in jail and he paid his time. But the fact is, we're here today not because of what occurred to him 10 years ago and the time that he spent in jail, but because of a doctor's improper medical care and treatment that occurred to him only three years ago. And during the course of this trial, you're going to see that that has absolutely nothing to do with the events in this case or the treatment rendered to him by this doctor that he has brought a case against. So now what have I done? What I've done is diffused a potentially dangerous situation. And if I had omitted that critical piece of information, that weakness in the case, that would have destroyed my credibility. So by admitting a weakness during opening arguments, I gain a significant advantage. And it's something that very good experienced trial attorneys will often do. They will diffuse the situation by coming out with it first, letting the jury know about it so that there's no hidden secrets. So why do I tell you this? I tell you this to give you an insight and understanding into how certain things work at the time of trial here in the state of New York. And chances are you're watching this video, you have questions about possible litigation involving medical malpractice, negligence, or maybe even wrongful death. Well, what I want you to do is I want you to pick up the phone and call me. I answer legal questions like yours every single day, and I welcome your call. You can reach me at 516-487-8207 or by email at lawmed10yahoo.com. I'm Jerry Oginski here in New York. Thanks so much for watching.